All right, so we're back for part two of the Hummer build. We got the back painted and reinstalled already. Looks pretty decent. Seats are gray. There's the back, it has back seats as well. Speakers down there, charger, forward and reverse. Put in a couple more inverters and stuff. Good Trojan batteries in this thing. This thing's kind of unique because it has a built-in charger. You basically just take an extension cord, plug it in that port, and that's it. It's ready to go. Still got to put the front on. Got a lot of lights and wiring to do. As you can tell, I got 25 feet of wire I plan to use. And yeah, looking pretty decent so far. I think so. Got tail lights in. Upgraded everything to LED bulbs. Like I said, there's a seat that sits here. As well as Velcros right there, so you won't see none of this stuff. I'll be covered. We put these handlebars back here because it didn't have any. The marine handlebars, they, they're for a boat. Had a lot of cleaning to do once we get back together. Bumper goes there, so you won't see that stuff down there. It's coming together pretty decent, though. Looks a lot different with the stuff on it. Opposed to with the stuff off of it. It'll look a real different once I put the front fenders on it. About to install the grill. Got a brand new LED headlights, LED bulbs in here. I painted this ring red just to kind of match the tone of the paint. These bulbs are pretty pricey. They're five and three quarter inch bulbs. But man, they're bright. They have high and low. I'm just gonna set them on the high beam. There's also a bumper goes here that has two fog lights that will match these. All right, so we got it put back together so far. We even did some buffing on it. Get to look a lot better. Let me show you. This is what we started with. Kind of a dull and dingy look. And see, scroll in, you can't even see nothing. And this is what we are at right now. See reflections. Kind of hard to get a good picture. See my hand. See my reflection in it. Yeah. As opposed to that. Boy, let's go to the other side. The other side's completely done. We got the front. As you can see, got a perfect shine on it. A weird glare in here you can't really see what I'm talking about but you can see reflection in it pretty good same as the back should be able to see yeah it's getting a little dark we'll have to pull out in the sunlight to show you the way it works but it's got a good reflection reflection nice and smooth as opposed to this is what it was this is what it is Got the front put on. Got a lot of wiring to do still. It does work. We hooked the ignition up just to make sure. All the batteries are in. Everything's good. Front end looks pretty good with those headlights on it. Charger and putting in a fuse panel. Clean the windshield, but we got it on. A lot of wiring to do. Yeah, it's coming along pretty good. Tomorrow we'll be able to pull it out of the shop and actually put some time in it. Get all the wiring caught up and almost done. Get this thing ready for delivery. Get the bars put back on for the roof. Still got to paint the roof, which is out there. Right there. Little black. Where's my finger? There it is. Little black roof right there. Get that painted and it'll be ready to go. All right, so just to bring everybody up to date on the Hummer now, we finally got out of the shop. Let me show you, we got the hood on it since the last video. The roof is painted and installed. We got the lights on the side. We got the lights up on the roof, which are right here. I don't know if you can see them, but there's little light strips on the roof. There we go. Got the mirrors back on, little decals back on. I think we had the grill in. We got all that bolted up. Everything shined up, looking like new money. 
Got a couple wires still hanging. We just buffed it with uh, Meguiar's Ultimate. It actually buffs up really good with that stuff. We Once we painted it, we hit it with uh, 1,000 grit in series up to 3,000 grit. Then we hit it with um, medium cut Meguiar's. And then we finished it off with the Meguiar's Ultimate Compound. Gave it a pretty slick look. I mean, it's, it's pretty decent. For a rattle can paint job, you can't complain. Yeah, we got lights underneath too. I'm not gonna really get down there and show all that. The seats on. Got all of our gauges on the dash. Let's see. Got the headlights, which are actually so bright, they'll light up that. But turn them headlights on for you. Man, them things are nice. Tail lights, blinkers, everything's hooked up. Got a horn, hazards. I mean, you name it, this thing's got it. Hazard lights, they're pretty decent. Back seats on, cleaned up. We still got a little bit of cleaning to do. But for the most part, I think it came together. Got the fan on the dash, two speeds, high and low. It turned out pretty good. Hit the wires pretty good. Had to put the control box. I don't know if you can see it, but it's right there in the middle. Put that control box. That's for your, your remotes. Radio's in. Got it working. Yeah, I think this thing's turning out good. Really, all we got left is a little bit of cleaning. Get some of this polish off. You know, the overspray from it. And then we got to put the bars back right here. I'm going to put a little metal plate here to help support them. And once I put the bars back on, got the seat belts on, that, that completes it. That'll be it. So this thing will be in the books and ready to go. It was a heck of a job. But I think it turned out really decent. Really nice paint job. In my opinion. Yeah. Oh, we got to put a windshield wiper on it. That's right. We got to drill a hole and put a windshield wiper. But that won't take but just a minute. Let me show you what these lights will do. Alright, so this is the lights at night with radio. Pretty cool. So yeah, it all come together pretty good. Toggle switches operate the lights. Or I can turn them off when I'm done with them. That's it. We're going to put these side bars on, put the windshield wiper on. We're going to call this one good. Then we're going to get jumped on this lift kit. Finally got it in. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Y'all stay tuned. Like, share, subscribe. Let me know what y'all want to see me build.